Hey, how you doing? Sean McGough here. If I post this, hit that like, hit, share, subscribe, whatever. Anyway, I make these videos because my kids told me, Dad, what are you doing? I thought you were going to write a book. That's right. I lost, well, according to my wife and a lot of others, I lost my mind. I'm telling you, I talked to God. My shrink, she says it was marijuana. You say whatever you think it is. So I say, you can follow me if you want. I believe I have a higher calling and it's... I decided to make it a smaller calling. And I know it sounds crazy. There's a lot of videos. You gotta go back and watch. Yeah, I was high in a lot of them, but that wasn't why I talked to God. I'm straight right now, and I'm feeling God, and I actually gotta leave in a few minutes because I feel an energy. I have some soul that I gotta uplift. It's a long story. You gotta go back and watch. And just make them laugh, make them joke. Hey, how you doing? Maybe that's all it takes. That's all I want out of life. I'm doing God's work on a small status. I'm okay with that. That's Neither here nor there. You got to follow along. There's a lot of videos. I talk to everybody. I have a lot of political videos too. I'm a conservative. I voted for Trump and I like DeSantis 2024, but if they choose Trump, that's who I'm voting for. Look around you, America. This ain't what, he, I don't think Joe Biden, what he's doing is what you voted for. And uh, I don't think he's around the country. That's my opinion. Facebook, all you censors, whoever you are, look what they're doing with the English language. They're taking words out and all of that. Brandeis University. Oh, you used to be good. My brother-in-law went there. And I don't know what happened to you. A liberal school like you. you taking and destroying the English language. It's incredible. Anyway, I got a lot of political leans that I'm going to do. But I'm, I make these videos 10 minutes at a time for my wife and kids. And maybe they'll look at them sometime. They don't follow me. It's okay. Anyway, I'm feeling God right now. And I'm probably going to be late because I should have started this when I was thinking about it and I said I don't want to make the video who cares what the hell I'm saying and then I said I'll make the video for myself and listen to it maybe I'm crazy maybe I'm not maybe I'll see who I talk to and I'll let you know I don't know but I'll go talk to a bunch of people I always do I talk to everybody anyway that being said I make these videos and my kid says dad I thought you were going to write a book they harass me I said no I'll do it 10 minutes at a time on the video a lot easier so if they have a look back they'll see it well it's funny because we went to the soccer game today if you've as a family if you follow along you know how big that is i'm working on it i will talk about that at another time it's a long story go back and watch i don't have time for you right now i had to get to work anyway that being said 10 minutes at a time is the book that's how it works leave a comment leave it a Opinion. Maybe I'm crazy. Maybe I'm high. I'm telling you, I believe. And I just had my MRI on my brain, too. There's something growing up there. And that could be it, too. That's what one of the doctors thinks. That's a long story. You got to go back and watch that. Anyway, the tombstone, I felt my mother's. That's kind of why I made a video and then I erased it. It was too personal. But I, uh, for two days, I swear I could hear my mother's voice. And she used to talk. And swear at God as a kid. And that's where I learned it from. It's my subconscious. I know. Go back and watch the other videos. There's a lot of them. We'll talk about that. We'll talk about my insanity. I went to the VA hospital two weeks, uh, twice. And they did, don't believe I talked about it. They gave me medication. Slows my brain down. I tried to explain to you. It's in the videos. There's four voices. They're all flying around now. And the one that swears is swearing up a storm. If I could say what I really wanted to say right now, I hope I would have you laughing, but I can't say it because I promised God that I'd do good. Well, I promised everybody. I promised myself because I'm trying to be a better person with the help of God. You can believe that or if, uh, not. I tried to, uh, guy tried to get me into an argument at work. I was able to say, no, you know, I'm, I'm not falling for it. I'm not going into that trap. I told myself that. That ain't in my brain. I don't know. If anybody who knows me, I love to argue, but I said, nah, you know what? It's not, who, what are we changing? We'll never change each other's opinions. Never. He's a liberal. All he listens to is state-run media, and there's no point whatsoever, and I managed to get out of it, and it felt so good. And that, I'm telling you what, I said, Hail Mary and an Our Father, because I said, thank you, God, because once I start arguing, I don't shut up. That took me a 50, I don't know, ever since I've been talking, it took me that long to figure that out, that I don't, boy, I saw my whole life flash before my eyes, and all the people that helped me, the guardian angel around me, and the, my shrink don't believe that, and she, I don't know if she really believes in God, I don't, I asked her straight up, I asked a lot of people straight up, 
You believe in God? I'm not going to preach at you. I'm not going to get up on the pulpit. I'm not going to hold the Holy Bible. I'd still check out butts and boobs. Sorry, I'm a guy. You guys do. I told my I don't want my wife's button. Don't tell her I said that. She said, I'm still in the doghouse. And you know what? I thought we were going to split. It's in her video. I was scared. I was, And I told her, no, I'm not going to lie. I spoke with God. I felt it. I feel it now. There's some soul I may have already missed right now because I was already supposed to go and I procrastinate. That's in a different video. Shit. I probably missed the soul I was supposed to see. <laughs> anyway, you can call me crazy. That's okay. I'm telling you I talked to God. I don't know if I'll post this. I have a lot of political... But all, a lot of the, my politi politics... They're using race to divide. Look at the border. There was probably a Latino. If 15,000 people, no matter what race, go across any border, that's an invasion. That's an invasion. Who's it going to hurt when these people come across the border? Whose jobs are they taking? Who has to put them up? They got to live somewhere. The economy, people get back to work. They're hiring everywhere. These are videos I make. Oh, I wasn't supposed to go politics on this. I'm sorry. That's me, all right? And the voice that swears at me just said, Mother Effa, get back on course. That's how it works. That's the voice I was afraid of my whole life. I wouldn't have got that DUI. I wouldn't have been drunk boating. I wouldn't have been drunk snowboarding. And Well, yeah, I would have. But <laughs> I'm more carefully. I might not have tried to do the huge jump on the skis that time. Oh. That hurts. Don't do that. I didn't break the ribs, but they were bruised. Anyway, that's a different story for a different day. I've done a lot of dumb things. and Yeah, there were drugs and alcohol and all that involved. But And I know what it's like to be high, Doc. And I'm not high now. I do smoke a lot of the CBD. If you smoke enough CBD, it makes you feel just like you're high. Or just like it did those nights. That's where you see my hand shaking now. I feel the hand of God. So there is still another soul that I need to go talk to and save. Now, my doctor thinks that's crazy. Oh, you just feel like you got to go talk to other people. Do you feel like going out at night and just driving around? And You know what? Yeah, sometimes I do. And I'm also able to control that and not do it. Or I'll just go and talk to somebody or feel something or take a little ride and feel like I'm bringing my energy of God all around that neighborhood. And there you go. That's it. I know that sounds crazy. Maybe it is crazy. But if I'm bringing God to a neighborhood, to people, to bringing any kind of joy to anybody, even at a small basis, small amount, and you can think I'm crazy, maybe I'm just, I'm not as fat as I used to be. God fat shames me. I've been walking two and a half, three extra miles a day, trying to eat healthier. I'm down the chins of Donald. But oh, come on. I'm going to hold the camera bad angle. Anyway, like I said, I'm not sure if I'm going to post this. But I feel like there's souls I need to save right now. And I am having a... Oh, it's a cheap one, though. God, I don't like the cheap ones. It's a long story. Anyway, like I said... Yeah, Doc. I love God. I believe God loves us. I don't know where we end up. I, I'm telling you, I saw 50 years when I spoke with God. If we stay on this trajectory, and that's, yeah, that's conspiracy theorists, whatever you want to call it. This ain't the last video I make, but it's, uh, it might be the last time I talk about this. But the trajectory we're going on ain't going to be 50 years. If you keep allowing this racism and everything is everybody else's fault and the division and everybody's separating them each other into tiny little groups instead of the red, white, and blue, it won't even be 50 years. I just hope the total demise isn't in my lifetime. But Jesus, everything every American fights for that the red, white, and blue stands for, you want to throw it away. And I don't get it. But somewhere in me, there's a book. It's 10 minutes long. 10 minutes at a time. It's the bathroom book. Maybe you listen on the toilet once in a while. But everybody has a book in them. That's I didn't make that up. That's I've read, read a lot of books. I've listened to a lot of books. Take a listen to 1984. Take a listen to Animal Farm. 
Those were warnings from God. That's what I saw when I met, when I talked to God, I would mention books, I would mention movies, I would mention this. He put me back on track. It's a long video. Anyway, I've gone over my 10 minutes. I'm not sure if I'll post this. If I do, if you like what I say, if you want to follow, feel free. Most of my stuff isn't titled because I do a lot of swearing. It's when I, yeah, I was listening to God and saying what he wanted and that's how I hear God. You can believe that. Yes, uh, maybe I'm crazy. But I believe in a higher power. I believe in the Trinity. There's a lot of other politics that I've come around to. But 10 minutes at a time, if you want to follow, feel free. If I make you laugh, if I can make your day better, I hope and pray. And you go ahead and pray along with me. One of these days, I'll learn how to monetize, sell your t-shirts, and do all that crap that everyone else does. I don't know. One of these days. But anyway, I'm not sure if I'll post this. Like I said, I make these for me to analyze myself. If I post it, it's okay to that you analyze me too. And one day, my kids will look back and say, yeah, Dad was crazy, but he meant well. God bless you. God love you. Amen.